Hey, Saul, how you doing today? Yeah, how you doing? Good, good. Yeah, I was wondering if I could talk to you about Jeremy and his homework. It's been late. And, you know, we started trying to give out the homework early, you know, on Fridays to, um, you know, help them complete it a little bit easier. That makes sense. That was two weeks ago. Um, he was late again. I was wondering if maybe you could talk to his mother and just have a sit down and help Jeremy be successful. Uh, yeah, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Vanessa and I will chat with them, uh, and we'll try and get this back on track. All right? Thanks, all. Uh, so, do we need to talk about your homework later today? All right. How about we go play a little hooky, and then, uh, we'll have that conversation, all right? All right, let's do this. then there wouldn't be any reason for me to pick you up. Besides, your mother and I cannot keep you locked up in the basement all day, every day. Is this really that important? I mean, don't they all have it covered? What good is your say if it's the same as everyone else's? Hmm, that's a good point. Look, at the end of the day, only you know what you put on that court, right? We spend a lot of time arguing over principles and policies, but when it comes down to it, only you know who you voted for. So, yeah, it kind of does matter, right? You never know who's got your interest or who's looking out for you. Yeah, but, but, but I don't have <sighs> Make you a deal. Tough this out with me, and when we're done, we'll go hit that uh, bowling alley arcade place you like. Earth? Boom. Democracy in action. I'm not saying it's good, but it could be a lot worse, right? It's the weekend. It's a break. Grown-ups just want kids to be miserable. <sighs> Look, your homework's due by the end of the week, right? Yeah. Okay, so if we try it this way, if we get all of it done on Saturday and Sunday, you're gonna have the whole week after school to, I don't know, what do cool kids do? Pwn noobs online? Sure. Look, let's just try it my way, okay? Stop procrastinating, stop putting it off, and then we'll be good to go, and then homework will be fun again, right? All right. All right, let's do this. Got a little ice cream on there? Come on, get it off. Yay, homework! Yay! Yay! Good morning, young man. How are we doing today, Jeremy? Oh, you feel it against your face, young man. We have a great day of going to the library ahead of us. Are you not excited? No. Are you not? Come on, are you not excited and ready to go for the day? All right. I hate to tell you this. This is your last and final warning. Are you prepared? All right, young man. I gave you an opportunity. You have brought this upon yourself. Oh, it is time to get up. It is time to up. It is time to wake up. Come on, come on. Come on! Oh, we have an awesome day that awaits us! Sleep good last night? Yeah, before you came in and woke me up. Aw. Oh. I know. You ready for today? Yeah. Alright, let's do it. Alright, it's like chess club, like you rock a chess club, right? You have fun doing that. I think chess was invented. I don't know what they've been. Smart people play chess. Play chess is for smart people. We're in a place of smartness. Same kind of thing. And they got lots of notebooks in the section we're going to go study. Excellent. All right, get out that homework. Get out your laptop. We had to do our homework with pens and pencils when I was a kid. Let's see how this looks, okay? Ready to go. Rockies or Appalachians? West or East, if you had to pick? 
can see I'm feeling it. We'll get me and your mom. Yes, you are. Don't take care of yourself. Gone somewhere. I'm gonna take a trip over to Vegas. did it look at that one day everything you needed to do all done i and I, I never want to do that again oh, come on talk to me on friday when you've had the whole week to do all these cool fun things you want to do i'm i'm, I'm never talking to you again you know that right well you can choose to do whatever you want with all this extra free time we just made <laughs> uh Hey, uh, I gotta run to the bathroom. Are you good? Yeah. All right. All right, listen to the music. I'll be right back. I'll tone the news. Oh, ooh. Pew, pew. I feel ya. All right. I'll be right back. Hi, excuse me. Mm -hmm. uh, I need to run to the restroom real quick. My son's back there just working. Would you mind keeping an eye on him real quick? Oh, sure. Not a problem. Thank That'd you so fine. much. I appreciate it. Not a problem. Hey. You know what I was thinking? Jeremy? Hey! Jeremy! I don't know where he's at. No. Oh, he's going to take care of himself, but I promise you that we are going to find him. How's he supposed to get his mints? I don't know. We'll put every time and resource and moment that we have into bringing him back. Great job there. Uh, thanks, Mr. Packton. I'm, uh, you know, just doing my part. Oh, you're doing a fantastic job. Speaking of doing my part, <clears throat> I heard the news. I'm just checking in on you. Do you need some time? No, no, I'm gonna be good. You know, I'm just uh, doing my job. Just trying to keep busy. Business as usual. Yeah. Impressive. Keep up the good work. I'm not going. It doesn't feel right to be there.
used to be you didn't want to go just so you could watch deer. Have you tried going to them since? It would be like a failed experiment. Jesus, Vanessa, you were the one responsible that day. You caused this. You don't think I'm aware of that? What about this whole situation do you think I am enjoying right now? Oh, I don't know. Maybe that you're not doing anything about it? I mean, look at you. Do you even care? How dare you ask that question? Where were you? Do you not think that I'm aware that every single person out there thinks I am responsible for this? You think I left some sign in the library? Hey, steal our kid, he's here for free. There is not a single thing that you can say that's gonna make me feel any different. So how about this, Vanessa? How about you just back off? So where was this? This, it took you months of sulking to wake you up? Wake me up, wake me up. Do you not think that I am in hell at this very moment? I wish to God I was anything but awake. Yeah, you certainly made that obvious. Well, guess what? I'm still here. I, I have nothing. I have nothing left for you, Vanessa. You sit here and hide in this home, worried about what people are gonna say to you or what they might think of you. Why don't you grow up? Oh, yeah, that's right. Take it all out on me. Mm, it's what you live for, isn't it? Do you know why everyone out there is not shocked that you're around? Because you've never been around Jeremy publicly. And you picked a fantastic time to start. I thought I could help address security around the schools. Oh, perfect. It's a little bit late for that, don't you think? No, I'm, I'm done. This and trying to put on some happy face. It's go to work, put on a happy face. It's come here around you, put on my happy face. Dr. Pearson, do you have a minute to answer a few questions about Jeremy Dragmar? Sure, sure. Did you notice anything unusual with Jeremy? Uh, no different than any other young, young man. How about his father? Can you comment on his father? Uh, he was a bit absent. Uh, you, you know what? I probably shouldn't be talking about a child's parent. It, it, th thank you so much for your time. I'm thank going you. this door instead. Thank you, doctor. You hear that? Exactly. You see... I've been very quiet, folks, about a particular issue that's been going on in the news as of late. However, seeing how things have been trickling out about this matter, I decided that it's time for me to speak. <sighs> so, it's been about, not about, it has been eight years since the disappearance of young Jeremy Dregmar, and the police are no closer to a conclusion. Forgive me, but it gets my goat because the guilty party has been in plain sight all along. Yes, I'm talking about none other than Thomas Dreadmar. Now you say, why would he kill his own child? Huh? It happens all the time. I hate to say it, it's on the news day in. What am I making this? This man's no different. Uh, think, he was just a sensational star. television. I mean, this guy's far from an objective jerk. No, not that, damn it. I could care less what this guy says. My question is, how did you have this glaring hole in your data? Your information wasn't up to date. It didn't reflect that a competitor was scooping up the market out from under us. You cost us millions 
by buying a company that was on its way out. I get it, man. I know some are gonna say, oh my god, how can you do it? Slanting me a grieving man. Player, <laughs> why are you grieving? See, I ask that question because Jeremy hasn't been found yet. And what kind of parent doesn't hold out hope and pray for the return of their only child? Unless you know something that we don't know. Does this have to be on? Amen. Amen. Yes. I think it does. He's making more sense than the man standing in front of me. He's certainly not the analyst that worked for me two years ago. No. No, that time, he triple-checked his facts. He took care of us every step of the way. And whether or not you like it, this Tom? is your life. What do we make here? You are really not pulling that one on me right now, are you? What do we make here? Money. Louder? Money. Right. I tried to take care of you. I tried to give you time. You turned it down. You wouldn't even lighten the load until things cleared. Sounds like we'd be in this position regardless. I guess upset it's my fault. You're damn right. You're damn right I am. I can't make any exceptions. This you screwed up big time. I'm gonna need you to clear out your desk. I only had seven years still. So you got it, you were done. You're tired of it. I get it. Now folks, listen to me closely. This isn't for him. This is for us. The same ones, the ones who understand responsibility and take better care of one another. We have got to do better. This means, as they say, if you see something, say something. And if anybody, anybody, has a problem or is standoffish about your concerns about what's going on with them, well, maybe they need it a little bit more. I pray you've heard my message and that we are all better for it. Check on you. Your neighbor said you haven't seen anyone in a few days. Uh, we're still here. Can I come in? Yeah. There's a uh, some water, a cup, in the faucet. Get your stuff at home. Home. Smells good. Looks good in here. It's with the t-shirts, huh? Uh, it's just uh, it's just something of Jeremy's. How many times am I going to see this, Tom? It's, uh, as long as you keep coming here. I understand, Tom. I'm following myself. Good looking kid. Tom.
got to shake this man. You gotta get better, man. You gotta get better, bro. That's better, Jeremy, right? That's better. But, but I don't Feeling better? I am now.